Today's best music mix. Free Radio. Hey, I'm JD from The JD Show on Free Radio. Now, over the past week, you've been voting for your favourite teacher across Coventry and Warwickshire. And thanks to our friends at PetXI, one primary and secondary school teacher are going to win their school £1,000. So let's meet our first JD hero. Stop number one. We're about to present a cheque for £1,000 to Oldermore Farm Primary School in Stoke Oldermore. But before we do, we need to thank our friends at PetXI who've supported this. What do PetXI do, Aaron? At PetXI, we run a, a number of summer transition programmes and booster classes. Um, we work very closely with the, the students and teachers throughout the country, um, looking at improving students' engagement and also their overall SATs levels. OK, let's go in and surprise our first teacher on JD's Heroes. Hello, hello. Is Victoria Dalton here? Yeah. Victoria, hello. I'm JD from Free Radio. Are we all right? Hello, class. Yeah. You all right? Hi. Now, Hi. Victoria, uh, yeah. you went on freeradio.co.uk to tell us about yeah. your favourite teacher. Yeah. Um, who was that teacher? Mr. Chilinski. Oh, I'm getting upset. Oh. Um, and why did you decide to tell us all about your teacher? Because he's an amazing teacher, he's done so much for me and I'd just like to thank him for that. Oh, well, Victoria, I've got some good news for you. Your nomination has won you £250. <laughs> Look at that. And you've got some flowers. So thank you for going on our website and making that nomination. We want to see your pretty face on the camera. Let's. But but tell me a little bit more about your teacher. He's just he's fantastic. He's so funny. Everyone in the whole school is it's a blessing to have him as our teacher. He's just he's the most amazing person I know. I'll never get a teacher like him ever again. Oh, she's adorable. <laughs> well, I haven't paid. Her. We asked everybody to vote for their favourite from the shortlist. And I'm pleased to say that Mr Chavlinski has won the school £1,000! <laughs> Let's bring in the cheque. Let's prove that it's real. There you go. <laughs> Sir. Thank you very much. You have won Oldermore Farm School £1,000 and you are officially a JD hero. <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> officially a JD yes, hero. Yes, you are. Thanks to the I nomination. Am, I am absolutely honoured. I mean, thank you first and foremost to Victoria Dalton because she did nominate me. But then, I mean, a JD hero, I don't think I quite deserve that accolade, but my class... Honestly, it's made so easy by every person in this class to be the teacher I am, and I want to thank every single one of them. And all the staff at Oldermore Farm have been so supportive. So Can we that. have a round of applause? <laughs> so, what do you think the school will spend the £1,000 on? Well, I'll go on holiday. <laughs> <laughs> no, um... <laughs> We, well, I am, I am a big, big literacy fanatic. I love literacy. I'm obsessed with reading. Some of the girls have helped with the library, so every, I think we'll be spending that on something for the library. Okay. Absolutely, and I think that would be amazing. Well, well done to you, sir. Well done, Thank Victoria, you. and well done to Oldermore Farm. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations. Right, should we all do a little bit of a dance? <laughs> So, Mr Chalinski has just won Oldermore Farm £1,000 thanks to JD's Heroes and Pet XI. We're now off to do exactly the same, but this time find out the winner of our secondary school. Our secondary school is Trinity Catholic School in Leamington, receiving the most votes on JD's Heroes. Now, Aaron from Pet XI is with me again. He has the cash. Uh, what do you do in secondary schools? Uh, we run a number of intense booster programmes and training classes throughout the UK. 
focusing on getting students GCSE levels from maybe, for example, a D to a C. So what we do is we put a guarantee there, John, that we'll go, uh, that 70% of that class will go from a D to a C. Um, and if that guarantee's not there, then the, the school doesn't pay. Brilliant. And you work alongside teachers to make sure that this is done, don't you, with their pupils? Yeah, we work, we work closely with the students and the teachers, um, just focusing on the engagement. Um, and the classes we put on, we try and put a pet twist on them um, that enables the, the, the classes to be, to sort of put, by a pet twist, I mean, put a fun effect onto the classroom sessions. Right, well, it's lunchtime here. It's getting a bit crazy. We're about to go and congratulate the student that nominated and find out who is the best secondary school teacher in Coventry and Warwickshire. I'm here with Neetu Purewall, who made the nomination for this school. Uh, who did you nominate and why? Um, I voted for Chris Gabbert because ever since he got appointed head teacher, he's just been a great head who all the students, all the teachers can just confide in. And also, after hearing about a student in year 11 who got diagnosed with cancer, Chris then shaved his hair off. So I was wow. just kind of like really admiring for all the students and we just had so much respect for Chris. Um, and also, this time last year, my best friend Becky Bishop passed away and Chris did his absolute best to organise concerts, performances, help us fundraise for ideas. For, we want to get a bench for her, so yeah. he helped us fundraise ideas and just anything that, any troubles or issues we had, we could always just go to speak to him. So I just thought I'd nominate Chris because I thought he really deserved to win the award. Well, he made the shortlist and we asked people to vote for their favourite. Yeah. And for nominating, you have got yourself £250. Oh my God, thank you. Can we give a round of applause? Well done. Thank you. Um, that's yours from Pet XI. What do you think you'll spend the money on? Um, I'm not sure, maybe driving lessons or nice, something. Nice, yeah. nice. Well, good luck with that. That's yours. Okay, thank you so much. So now we need to find the, the okay. man in question and let him know that um, he's won the school £1,000. So uh, are you going to lead the way? I will. Okay, I'm following you. Okay. So, so, um, oh, can I call you Chris? Yeah, oh, thank everyone, you. Everyone calls me Chris. And, oh, even the kids? Yeah. All oh, right. Now, uh, sorry, we're trying to get everybody in the room. Come on, come on. Now, on free radio, yeah. uh, we've worked with Pet XI and we've been looking for the best teachers in Coventry and Warwickshire. Now, I've just been to Oldermore Farm Primary School to give them uh, some good news. And because of your nomination and all the votes that we've had, you're the winner. Oh, that's great. And we've got the school, a thousand pounds. That's even better. So congratulations. Oh, thank you very much. Here Cheers. we go. There you go, Trinity Catholic School, one thousand pounds, courtesy of Pet XI. And the nomination came from the lovely girl next to us. Yes, I know. Who yeah. nominated you. Do you want to say anything to her? Yeah, thanks very much, Nate. It was very, very kind of you. I'm very humbled by that. Thanks a lot. You, you, from what she said, you've done some amazing stuff. A friend that passed away and also one of the pupils that had cancer, you decided to shave your head. Mm. Uh, it's, is that stuff that you just do, or? Um, well, the the head shaving was uh, was just something I promised one of his mates I'd do. So once he started losing his hair, I just shaved mine. Oh, fair play, mm. and also the bench as well. I mean, it was great that you did that. Yeah, yeah, but I mean, it's 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 um, I mean, it's very kind of you to, to mention. It's very kind of me too as well. But the, at the end of the day, it's 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 me too and her friends who are putting in all the effort. I'm just helping. Yeah. Tell me a bit about the school. How long you been here? Since April 2011, I was deputy and right. became principal in September. Uh, and and ta for someone that hasn't been to the school, what is it like generally? Oh, it's a very, very loving, caring place. Um, as I said, I mean, I'm called by my first name because we all teachers are called by their first name. There are no barriers here. Right. Like, we believe we're all equal. Um, it's, uh, you know, we, we believe strongly in principles of non-violence, but also in um, aspiration and excellence. Well, Chris, uh, you've won the school £1,000. What do you think that will go towards? I know what's going on. Oh, really? it's, um, it's, uh, <laughs> it's going to, um, I'll give it to my faculty principal in charge of um, performing arts and physical education because he uh, can regenerate our music and drama departments with that. Once again, Chris, I like the I'm calling him Chris, principal of uh, Trinity Catholic School. Well done. Can we give him a round of applause? Well done. Thanks very much, mate. Cheers. Free radio. Free radio. Free radio. Today's best music mix. It's nice.